guys, I'm bringing my mom and my mother-in-law to do gown fitting for them today. So, yep, they are at Rafa's place right now. And I did my mom's makeup today. Okay, so the studio that we are going today is called Style Lease. I've heard about them like many times before because they often engage in like influencer marketing. So I've seen them a few times on Instagram but I've never actually been to their uh, studio before. So it's my first time there. And now I'm at, I think, Boat Key. So we are making our way there. beautiful than my gown already so no regrets Wardrobe. Okay, so the first uh, studio that we went to was actually Stylist. If you watch my vlog, I mean, of course you did. Okay, so I think Stylist has more varieties in terms of like the gowns and everything. But then you do have to note that for both of these studio, uh, most of their gowns cannot be like altered to your size. So they have like a selection based on sizes. So it's not like bridal studio. You can choose like whichever gowns that you like and. They will like tailor it to your size. For stylists as well as the luxe wardrobe, they actually go according to sizes. So if you or your mom or whoever happens to find a gown that you really 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 like but 
you can't fit into the gown or it's like way too small or it's way too big I don't think there's much they can do for you so in terms of the selection wise I think Stylist has a wider range of selection because like the studio is slightly bigger compared to Lux wardrobe and both the service are about the same but of course for Lux wardrobe the lady who attended to us who is Priscilla she is actually the owner of the studio so that she will give you like recommendations suggestions based on like which color of the gown suits your skin tone better and based on your body shape she will also suggest accordingly so that was something that i really really like about Lux wardrobe when my mom tried on a few of the gowns i can really tell that like grey doesn't really look good on her because she has a yellow undertone so i feel that grey will not look good on her so even priscilla agreed with that so in terms of like the suggestion and recommendation i mean stylists if you ask them they will also give you suggestions and everything okay so moving on in terms of the price range i believe the price range is about the same both of them are pretty reasonable and affordable it's not like very 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 expensive i think these two places are great if you are looking to just rent a gown for an occasion a special occasion and you don't feel like spending like hundreds of dollars on a dress or a gown that you probably will not wear again especially if you think that it's just gonna be a one-time event so it's much better to like just rent and send it back to them and wear another style the next time than to like just have that one gown and you wear the same gown to like multiple events but of course it still depends on your budget and like the style that you like for all the brides to be out there i really recommend you guys to check out um, both style lists as well as Lux wardrobe if you are looking for a gown for your mother-in-law even for your bridesmaids or even for yourself because they do have the bridal selection as well that's just my quick thoughts and review on these two studios that i went together with my mom as well as my mother-in-law so yeah if you have any questions you can let me know in the description i mean you can let me know in the comments down below and i'll try my best to help you so that's all for today's video thanks for watching so remember to subscribe to my channel for more of my bride to be journey less than three months to the wedding so i'm really 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 excited and i'll see you guys next time bye